hi guys here in this video i'm going to show you that how you can uh, create a filter using tags so in this uh, specific store i have required a tag for all those products which are on sale so i am interested to put a filter that will show me only those products which are on sale so here on my screen you can see that i have this filter option and on the left we have on sale and off sale so this on sale if i am clicking on it so it will be filtering only those products which are uh, on sale all right so if i am clicking again and clicking on off sale so all the products will be displaying so how you can implement it into your store let me show you step by step firstly you should go to the dashboard of the store and here you can see that i have reformation theme if you have any other theme then still this will work you only need to copy and paste the code you should click on these three dots click on duplicate once you are duplicating the uh, theme because uh, later on if you want any backup that you can restore it back and then click on edit code here i have already added the code so let me quickly remove that code and then i will paste it in front of you so i have this file on sale dash filter so i am going to remove this click on delete click on delete file and we have also added the render statement here so i'm going to remove that one also click on save and then after i'm going to refresh it back so now you will see that the specific uh, feature which i added here that is removed so let me show you step by step how i will be adding it back click on uh, actually i am going to back to the store again click on these three dots click on edit code and here you can see some folders and files click on snippet and here i need to add a new snippet click on add a new snippet and right here on sale dash filter and then click on done here i am going to paste a code which i already created so i am going to copy this code and paste it right here and inside of this code we are actually writing some uh, css this one is css and here i am writing a variable which is uh, mentioning the specific tag for which we are going to filter right now i have added on sale which later on i will be adding into all those products which i am interested to uh, display on the basis of this filter and this is those buttons which i am displaying over there like on sale and off sale and here you can actually modify this text on sale and off sale all right i'm going to save the changes and then after i am going back here and uh, searching those filters code so f a c e t actually this is the file here in this theme where i have this specific uh, drawer code so i am going to render that uh, new snippet just on the top so here is this form and inside of it i am going to render that so you should render click on render and then i am going to write the name of that file on sale filter and comma and then i have to send the url uh, of the current collection so how i will be writing here you should copy the name of this sale url and that is this one and then colon and here actually this is the result url which is actually the collection url so i'm going to copy this variable and pasting here and that's how this specific uh, url will be passed and then click on save now i'm going to refresh it back and let's see that it is showing or not click on this and on the top you can see on sale off sale so if i'm clicking on on sale you can see that these specific uh, products are displaying if i am going to tops collection and uh, clicking on this filter and on the left if i'm clicking on on sale you can see that on sale products are filtered so that's how you will be adding this feature one more change which you have to do is you should go to the dashboard again and here you can see we have products and on each of the product which you are interested to uh, use this filter with so you should write there the tag name so for example for this product i am also interested to display so here you should write on sale and click on add and then click on save so for say example i am refreshing it back here you can see that the new product which i added for on sale to display uh, i mean the tag i added so accordingly this is also showing here if i am removing that uh, on sale clicking on off sale so 
all these products will be displaying on sale will be that filter will be removed so that's how you can implement it into your store so if you are facing any problem then definitely you can uh, connect me i will help you out in that so i have already added the contact details below in the description so you can uh, uh, send me the message and i will definitely help you out in that thank you so much for watching this video if you are new on this channel then please like this video also subscribe this channel thank you once again see you in the next video